and as you can see, it's right behind me. This place is called Rolling Greens. They have three locations in Los Angeles. One is in uh, downtown LA, one is also in LA, but it's close to Hollywood area. And another one is in Culver City, which is the biggest. But we're, vis we're actually visiting the newest one, the one in downtown LA. Uh, this one, the nursery is uh, relatively smaller compared to other two, but uh, this one is a little closer to my house. So we're gonna go to this one first. And if you guys love this nursery, and uh, we are gonna go do a Rolling Queens part two, part three in different locations. Start this video, I wanna apologize to you guys that we left in a hurry, so we forgot about our mic. So we probably gonna sacrifice the the audio quality a little bit but it shouldn't be too bad I hope you guys do enjoy it okay you ready let's go Okay guys, since we don't have a mic and this place has a fan blasting so I'm gonna talk louder and I'm gonna shout my face right in front of the camera right in front of your screen, please don't mind me. Okay, so let's see what they have here. This is a Sandra Kena 1250. Ooh, so lush. And then we have some rubber plants. This is a Ficus Elastica 1075 Guys, that is not bad If you've been following my video for a long time You know that we found some pretty freaking expensive ones So 1075 for this guy is not bad at all Here's some variegated ruby Ficus Elastica Ruby for 1075 I love the red, pink variegation on this. Oh, that is so cute. Here's a margarine Pena for twelve fifty. Some other Dracaena as well. Nine seventy five. That is pretty good. It has three stamps for nine seventy five. You can probably split it into three plants and give it to friends. Here's some lemon lime dracaena, twelve fifty in a six inch pot. This is so healthy and lush. Okay, I guess this aisle is the heaven of dracaena. And this guy is dracaena in the eight inch pot for twenty nine fifty. Got two stands in there, two plants in there. Oh, what happened right here? Oh, this guy is not dead, but this guy is growing like sideways. <laughs> but somebody, if somebody get it, please like help it to grow upward again. This guy is 24.50. Wait a second. Oh, cool, sideways. <laughs> this is funny. But I, I think they just need a drink of water, actually. Yeah, they look still healthy. I think they just need water. Usually, these guys are not like dramatic type. They wouldn't just go soft when you don't give them water, like like the Fatonia or Zebra plant. 
they're pretty hearty. So I've never seen them doing this. This one is the Dracaena Marginata. Okay, eight inch pot for $25. This guy has three pins. Hey guys, if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. This is a Aglaonema hybrid. So this guy is in the eight-inch pot for forty dollars, thirty-nine fifty. Let me show you how big this guy is. This is so cool, and the plants are really healthy. Let me tell you, really good, like really good for forty dollars. But I think this is also Aglaonema, but it's just a different species. But the small one over here, six inch pot, is twelve fifty. That is not bad. Look at how beautiful this guy is. Their leaves look like a little sword. So this is a jade tree. This is really cool. It looks like a bonsai too, huh? Which is very easier to take care of because it's a succulent. Oh, baby! Look. What's this? It's your favorite. Oh, jasmine. Jasmine. Not so. Smells pretty good. Smell, smell it. Yeah, smell good. Yeah. We can have it in our patio. It's not so full though. Let's see how much. It doesn't have so many flowers. You gotta wait. You gotta take care of it so it will bloom for you. You don't just buy things that's in full bloom. Um, see, it's the price is over here. Okay, yes, right here. This guy is pink jasmine, an eight-inch pot for twenty-four fifty. And this is in a smaller pot, in a six-inch pot. This guy is ten fifty. Naginella moss in a six inch pot for five dollars. This this uh, this guy is a terrarium plant. So if you are looking to build a terrarium, this guy is a perfect choice. And here we have some fern fern mothers in a six inch pot for ten dollars seventy five. Looking really good. Oh, and also burn as fern. You can't never go wrong with burn as fern. Bird nest fern is actually what got me to start my entire plant journey. I bought a bird nest fern from Trader Joe's and then my plant addiction started from there. Just look crazy. But yeah, this guy is in a 6 inch pot for $12.50. And it's really cute. You can see they grow little babies from inside of this. It's like all the adults, all the family members are protecting the kids. It's like every time I look at them, make me happy. And this is a quarter line, six inch pod for ten seventy five. Pongo's fern for ten seventy five, and some maiden hair fern for ten seventy five. Oh, this baby is a lush one. It's a huge one. Huh? Okay, this is also a fern that's 1075. This looks so cool. I've never seen this in any other nursery. This is really cool. What fern is that? Oh, it's also maiden hair. But I love this maiden hair. How they have like this pink. Wow. This is crazy. Actually, pink looks like uh, the new growth. All the new growths have this pink color, pink dye. For $9.25 in a 6 inch pod. If you're looking for a bigger one, this guy is $23. This is how big it is. Oh, there's more ferns. This guy, this is a honey basket. This guy is in an 8 inch bucket for $24.50. Love these patterns on a 1950 8 inch. Oh, this guy is really lush, really big. Wow. Oh my god. I've never, I swear, I've never seen such a huge Chinese money plant. 
and a highly pet Romeo in any nursery ever. This is crazy. Okay, let's see how much. Right here, twenty nine fifty. I would say that's not a bad price for twenty nine fifty. Look at this. Let's let's count the babies in here. There's one baby here. Okay, so this is actually. Oh my gosh, I can't even count because that's a big one in the center. I would say there's like 10 options in there. Yeah. Guys, if Josh can get you, get you guys in there, maybe you can take a good look. Look at these. My god, you can probably separate 10 plants out of this guy. This is crazy. Look at the biggest leaf. It's like half of half of my palm. This is cool. There's an even bigger one. We're gonna get around over there and then I'll talk about the other one. The other one is even bigger. Here's a zebra plant with lots of growth up here. This guy is 1050. Looking gorgeous. And here is this goldfish. Yes, this is goldfish plant. 1075. When this guy bloom, it has this cute little flowers look just like goldfish. So this guy's really cute. Uh, oh, here is a Hoyer Canosa. Variegated. Let's see. This guy is in the 6 inch pot for 1350. That's good, huh? That's really good. Look at the pink. <gasps> look at the pink. I don't have a lot of pink, but this is really cute. And that's a silver pink, I think. That's what we have, a pubica. I got mine from uh, Armstrong Garden Center, if you guys remember. I got it for $14.50. I don't know, they don't have a price over here, but I'm thinking probably similar price. What's this? This is a, is this a variegated Aurelius? I don't know, they didn't label it, but I'm thinking it's Aurelius. It's in a four inch pot for 375. This is a Photonia for 1150. That's a very crowded pot. Stack one fur, look how pretty that is. Publica, sorry I keep calling this name wrong, but here is the name. Hoya Publicolix. Oh God, sorry if I butchered it. It's just in a six inch pot for $13.50. Look how lush that is. Honestly, this guy is like three times as big as the one I got. I can't. I know how many of you, probably so many of you are freaking out right now just like me. Dude, this is crazy. This bucket is like bigger than my face. This is a 10 inch pot, Pylea Peperomios for $49.50. And I can't even begin to tell you how many offshoots, how many plants is in here. Okay, there are probably four large mother plants and a bunch of babies. So you can have like a house party and everybody can take one happily with them. Oh, this is so awesome. This is really awesome. But if it were, I probably would take this one. It's also very, very lush and it's only 29. Oh. Unbelievable. I'm thinking about it, but I do have a plant bun I put on myself because I've been ordering too many plants online and I've been neglecting some of my babies at home. So I decided to spend more time with the babies I with the plants I have instead of keep buying more and shoving them into the shelf. So we'll see what happens. We'll see. Some classic monsteras on a pole. This guy is 24.50. That is not a bad price. It's a um, the uh, Monstera Deliciosa. See, you have some pretty good fenestrations on the bigger leaves, adult, more mature leaves already. And then you have a bunch of small leaves down there. This will be a good one for a gift. $34.50. Mm -hmm. 
there's the peace lady for $5.50 and then there's the pepperoni pull this out it's $7.50 pepperoni in a 4 inch pot here's some palms and cocaine and again some smaller size ferns Super cute orchids for $14.50. Some bromeliad. It is $10.75. This bromeliad is in a 6-inch pot for $19.50. If you want to know the name, it's called Bromeliad Neoregalia. Yeah, if you want to search for this guy. Wow, imagine mounted on a wall. Super cool. So good. The price is $21.50 for this huge one. And this is a strings of pearls as well. It's $12.50. This is like a bigger version of strings of bananas. And this guy is $12.50. Flower had another flower. It's so fun. Like a flower actually had a real flower. Okay, let's go check out some big boys. I love the shape of leaf. It's like almost like a like a heart shape. It's a ficus triangular. Heaven of Pepperoni. <laughs> this guy is 1075. It's also a pepperoni. How gorgeous that is. I love the variegations on the leaves. Oh look at the new leaves. Philodendron Congo. This guy is a 6 inch pot for $10.75. Ooh, I love this. Look at the new leaf in the center. This is like a recently become really popular plant. Really, really popular. I mean, it's gorgeous. Look at the maroon colored stand. And this is a bird of. Uh, this is also a philodendron Congo, just a normal green color. This guy is $24.50. A much larger size compared to uh, this guy. of allocation right now because there's such a bench they're really hard to take care of in my opinion now I'm just I don't know if they want humidity they 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 they, they, they want to get dry in between watering I don't even know what they want anymore no matter how good you treat them they give you fungus nights <laughs> and I know a lot of you feel the same I I'm just I, I have a love and hate relationship at, with allocation right now. Here is one of my husband's favorite plants. We call this uh, elephant legs. But this is a rally Ming. This guy is 1275. And uh, in the last nursery haul, I was asking you guys why did they put the black stuff on here. Uh, apparently, a lot of you guys responded. It was really helpful. So when they like cut it. Uh, so it's basically like a like a scar. 
to prevent infection and stuff, it's just a type of plant wax to stop infection. Or sometimes they don't want this area to grow anything anymore, they just want to keep a certain size. Um, they use a certain type of wax to prevent that from happening as well. Pothos Brazil, let's see how much is this baby. 12.50. This is a, okay. This is, first of all, this is a clavia, and this is a species name. I, I can't say it, I'm not gonna say it. But oh. here, if you're gonna. Yeah, yeah if you wanna Google it, that's the name. It's in the six inch pot, this guy is only $10.25. Okay. Beautiful. I think this is probably the best deal I've ever found in this place so far. You're kidding, right? $10.25. Okay, let me check this again. Okay, eleven dollar fifty or ten twenty five. Why do they have two prices? But whatever it is, dude. What? How many of you are freaking out right now? How many of you? I know there's so many of you because I'm freaking out. Majority of the time, probably ninety nine percent of the time, I'm like, I really don't need that plant. Like, I don't even know that much about the plant. But that one percent of me take over and be like, get it because the price is good. So like a lot of times I get a plant just because the price is good. That's very irrational buying, impulse buying. Oh my gosh, the price is just keeps happening. Okay, we don't know how much is this begonia, but man, is this just gorgeous? That's crazy. Look at the metallic silver ray leaves and then the red bike leaf. My, my. Saladanje, is this a salad? Saladanje is a in a 10 inch pot for $45. $17.50 I don't think I've ever seen a snake plant bloom guys See a bloom So nice For bird nest snake plant $20 Here's some individual ones These guys are $12.50 One more coming, which means this guy's really healthy. But I do think maybe she needs to repot this guy a little bit. This big old plant is ten dollar and seventy five. I feel like some of you guys is gonna hate me if I don't get this guy. <laughs> I know how you guys are like. Jolie, get this. Jolie, get that. Jolie, buy everything. You guys are gonna bankrupt me. But this is this is I can't let this go. Yeah, I think this is the one. And thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know how you think about this nursery and if you would like me to do a part two, part three uh, of this nursery in other locations which are way bigger than this nursery. I probably have cooler plants too. And if you like this video, please give a thumbs up and also give a thumbs up to my awesome husband who has been filming for us. Whoopsies! Oh, it's gone crazy. I still don't know how to use this thing. My husband just got this. What's it called? Gimbal. Gimbal. Yeah. He's with 300 bucks. Bought this thing called gimbal, so it basically stabilized the image. Oh, by the way, guys, if you think this video is the quality is much better, except the audio, because I, I messed up with the audio. We forgot to bring the mic. If you think the image is way smoother and 
more stable compared to previous videos, please comment below so he can keep his toy because we do have 14 days that we can return it. I think it's too expensive, but he insists um, that it's gonna improve our image quality. So let us know how you think, and we love you. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.